And now, live from the Majestic Studios in Palo Alto, the Media Center Trivia Show with your host, Mr. Casey Hornbeek. Welcome, everybody. I'm Casey Hornbeek, and today we have our contestants. We have Aaron here, and we have Charles. How old are you, and where are you guys from? I'm 12, and I'm from San Francisco. How about you, Charles? I'm Charles, and I'm from Palo Alto. All right. Today we have five categories that we're going to be doing questions from. We have entertainment, we have history, we have geography, we have sports, and we have science slash math. Any, for any categories in specific to start? Um, how about entertainment? Entertainment. All right, the first question of the night is, how old is the... Rapper Drake. 38. Wrong. Dang it. 34. Incorrect. Um, you guys have four choices as a hint. You could either pick 31, 30, 35, or 28. First one to buzz gets the answer. What? 38. The correct answer was 31. None of you guys get it right. None of you guys get it right, so I get to pick the next question. It can be history. How? Who was Martha Washington? George Washington's wife. That is correct. I do not know that. Our first point of the night goes to Charles, and you start. All right. What category do you want to do? Sports. Sports. Your question for sports. What was the San Francisco Giants' original name? Um, oh, Baby Giants. No. Dang. Do you have any? The San Diego Giants. Incorrect. It is the New York Got Hands. <laughs> Our next question is entertainment. What movie won Best Pitch Picture in the Oscars in 2017? Moonlight. Correct. 2 0. What? Charles leads. It was La La Land, but Moonlight won on a mistake by the Academy. What what category would you like to do? Sports. Uh, sports. What strategy did the English cricket team use in the 1932 33 Athens series? Did they knock out the referees? <laughs> no. Um, they played intelligently. No, it was the body line strategy. Oh, Next five. question okay. is going to be geography. What? What is the capital of Spain? Rome. Incorrect. Rome is in Italy. Oh, dang it. Madrid. Correct. Oh. Except you didn't buzz, but I'll let you off this time. Oh, why are you so good? Three to zero, oh, yeah, Charles really leads. In, dang it, how I got Three that? points. What category would you like to do? Sports. Sports again, <laughs> even though you're 0 for 2 on it. Your I'll question really for sports is, what country has won the Davis Cup the most? Davis Cup. Wait, can I get an explanation on the Davis Cup? The Davis Cup is a tennis tournament. Oh. China. Incorrect. America. What is the real name of the country America? California. I don't know. <laughs> Incorrect. It's the United States. States. Oh, I thought you were like, not a You were this close to getting your first question. Ah, really? All right, our next question is going to be science. Okay. How far is the moon away from Earth? Oh, one billion, mil on one billion miles. What is it? One billion miles. No, Dang. it is 238,900 miles. Oh, really? It's a lot closer than the sun. That is incorrect. Your next question is history. The question is, who had 
biggest signature on the Declaration of Independence? John Hancock. Correct. Uh, a point for Charles. It's a sweep. It is four to zero. I have not. This two. game is becoming a blowout. What uh, category what? would you like to do next? Entertainment. Entertainment. What was the number one song in the world for the longest in 2016? One Dance by Drake, Closer, Chainsmokers, Work by Drake and Rihanna, and, or Sorry by Justin Bieber. Work by Drake. And Correct. <laughs> that is your first point. Yes. I'm so excited. What's it like to get your first point? Oh, it's like a, a, a feeling of excitement. What category would you like to do next? Entertainment. I'll stick with music. Entertainment. Who is Jay-Z married to? Beyonce. Correct. Dang. Five to one. Leading pretty big. Okay. What category would you like to do? Uh, science and math. Science and math. Can you pick two guys? Which is the hottest planet in the solar system? The sun. The sun is not a planet. <laughs> but it's the hottest thing in the whole world. But it's not a planet. Ah, uh, okay. Do you have any guess? Saturn. No, it is Venus. Ah, oh, I think I was about to say that too. You did that. All right. <laughs> Your next is going to be geography. Your question is which ocean lies on the east coast of the United States? Of America? Atlantic Charles. Ocean. That is correct. Thank you. Six to one. Charles with a big lead. And what category would you like to do? Science and math. Science and math, number three. How old is the sun? Um, as long as the dinosaurs. I don't know the exact time. Incorrect. It is 4.5 billion years old. Oh, okay. Your next question is history. Four, three. Which totalitarian leader called himself Deuce? Totalitarian? Like, uh, I can't get an explanation. Exactly. It, no explanation is yep. allowed for this question. It is Benito Mussolini. <laughs> Your next question is sports three. What country has won the... Sorry. What, what are the three teams in, in Sui's All-Star left Olympic? Could you repeat the question? <laughs> The question is, what are the three teams in Scooby's All-Star Last what's, Olympics? Wait, what, what's Scooby's? Exactly. No explanation needed. It is Yogi Yahoo Scooby Dooey's <laughs> and really rotten. <laughs> what? <laughs> these, these questions are ridiculous. Still, no sports questions have been answered correct. <laughs> Actually, no, you got the Davis Cup. Next question is... Entertainment five. Entertainment six. What is the show with Dre Johnson and his wife Rainbow, who is a doctor? Wait, what? <laughs> what is the show with Dre Johnson and his wife Rainbow? Can we get a hint? A hint is that a hint is that it is a realistic fiction TV show on CBS. Blackish. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Next is geography three. What is the world's highest mountain? Um, Mount Rushmore. Mount what? Mount Rushmore. Incorrect. <laughs> really? Mount Everest. Correct. Ah, <laughs> I was thinking of that one. I thought of that. Mount Rushmore. All right, your next question. Well, you get to pick the category. What is it? History. History. History four. Which African American man died in Bos in the Boston mass massacre? Oh, I know. Crippus attacks. Correct. Another one right. Eight to one. Oh god, this is at the break the score is eight to one. Charles leads big. I'm not getting none of these. <laughs> All right. What category would you like to do? Science and math. Science and math through four. What about math? How many time zones are there in the world? Twelve. Incorrect. Four. Incorrect. Really? Twenty-four. Oh, wow, I had four. 
Next is Sports 5. Who was the last Triple Crown winner before American Pharaoh? A hint is a Triple Crown winner is horse, is a horse race. Johnny Manziel. Incorrect. Johnny <laughs> Manziel is a football player. The next question. Who sang the national anthem for the All-Star Game in 2018? NBA All-Star Game. In 2018? Mm-hmm. Oh, I don't know. Fergie. Correct. Oh, oh, yeah. Many okay. think it was the worst All-Star Game ever. All-Star <laughs> National Anthem. <ever. laughs> I've seen that. It was horrible. What category would you like to do? History. All right, history. Who was the president before the ERA? The era of good feelings. Um, wait, is this like what time? Is, like, is that time zone? Like, no, it's not time zone. No, not time zone. I mean, like, was like, like, what type of year exactly? It was a long time ago. That's a hint. Abraham Lincoln. No. Oh. It's James Monroe. Oh, so <laughs> oh, you were not going to say that. All right, the question. I was like, I was like, I was going to be close at least. Which planet has the most moons? Super planet. I, I think so. Super planet is not a planet. Really? Saturn. Incorrect. It is Jupiter. Oh, Jupiter has like that many moons. Geography. What is the longest river in the USA? Longest river? I think it's. Um, the, um, no, it's, I, no, I don't know it, I forgot. Mississippi. Incorrect. It's the Missouri River that is 2,341 miles long. Mississippi. Sports. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm not getting This ready. sport introduced to the Olympics in 2000 is play, played on a raised platform in, by 16.5 by 9.5. It's an Olympic sport. Dart. Trampoline. Wait. <laughs> trampoline is a sport in the Olympics. Like you jump on a trampoline? Yeah, and they do flips. Oh, I could, I could, I could beat that. I could do the Olympics. <laughs> Geography. True or false? Asia has 40, 48 countries. True. Correct. That is your second one right. <laughs> Nine to two. I was a little out of that at all. Oh, Entertainment. Who played Ann Wheeler in The Greatest Showman? <laughs> All right. A hint is this person's name starts with a Z. But Zendaya. Zendaya. <laughs> if you know it's so all, you should know it. I, I, Who discovered the polio vaccine? Polio vaccine? Polio is a disease. I know. I don't know what polio is. Alexander Graham? Incorrect. Jonas Salt. Oh. Science. How many colors are there in a rainbow? Twelve. Incorrect. Really? By a lot. Oh, damn. Seven. Correct. I don't know. I was like, Another hey. point for Aaron. Wait, what? Sorry, not Aaron. Charles. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you're you raising my point. Aaron wishes. Wait, wait, wait there's a two. <laughs> what's, a, what's a two? Wait, oh. Wait, what's the other so one? So it's ten to two right now. <laughs> what is the smallest country in the world, area-wise? Fiji. No. Wait, smallest country area-wise? Yeah, size-wise. Not oh. population-wise. How big it is. Um, um, how big? Um, Mississippi. No. Mississippi's not a country. It's actually the Vatican City that Dang is recorded it. at 0 0.17 square miles. I didn't know that. Uh, I was, I was All right. 
We had two more entertainment questions. So we're not going to do that. Right now it is 10 points for Charles and two points for Aaron. It's a little bit of a blowout right now. We're at question <laughs> seven of sports. The, que the question is, what two San Jose Giants players hit for the cycle on April 12th, 2018 in the same game? It is Gio Brusa and Jalen Miller. That is a really, really hard question. Not sure who decided to make that. <laughs> Your question is, history. Which two men invented the airplane? Or which three men invented the airplane? Uh, I know it was the, the they were their brothers. Yeah? The, um, Give you half a point for that. Oh, I don't their name. The Ten seconds, or else Charles the, gets a chance. The, 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 five, four, three, I don't know. two, one. The Wright brothers. Correct. Ah. Half a point for Aaron, and <laughs> a full point for Charles. I do not The I Wright knew. brothers from North Carolina. Uh, I didn't know that. Your next question I knew the, is, I knew they were brothers. Yeah. which bone is the longest bone in the human body? Femur. Correct. I <laughs> read This next, huh? this next question is worth two points. Okay. True or false, the country Paraguay is in the Northern Hemisphere. False. Correct. Paraguay is located in the Southern Hemisphere, a landlocked country in South Africa. South America. Oh, Two I, points for Charles. Now's the chance, Aaron, to come back. <laughs> what is the very popular show of Noah Shinap as one of the main characters? Wait, very popular. Give me, can I get a hint? Can we get a hint? A hint is, it's a very popular show. Mary Poppins. Incorrect. <laughs> Mary Poppins is a movie. Okay. Um, a very popular show? Black Lightning. Stranger Things. Oh, that one. That's, 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 I don't like that. All right. Your next question. Which two men, sorry, which inventor invented more than 300 products from the peanut? George Washington Carver. Correct. I, I ah. Uh, uh, Since uh, you got it right, we'll give you a full point. So you have four now, and Charles has 14. Charles still up by... 14 points. I'm losing like a very good amount. <laughs> True or false? Or sorry. What is the capital of Fiji? Oh. <laughs> capital of Fiji? Nope, no one knows. <laughs> no, no. A hint is it starts with an F. San Diego. It is not San Diego, it is Suba. I don't think we really got that. I don't even think I really got that one. Yet. Aaron, if you win this, what will you do with the $30,000 that you're going to get? Uh, I'll probably spend it on candy. How about you, Charles? Uh, I would buy a new globe. <laughs> <laughs> well, speaking of Fiji, Fiji is right here on the map. It's a very beautiful place. And it's Suba Fiji, the cat. Oh, I have a question. What was the point of asking that other question? And how much money you're going to get? Yeah. Because we'd like to know here at the Midpad Media Center. Okay. All right. Your next question. Sports. Who, who were the top three world powers, world players in table tennis in the late 1990s? In the early 2000s. Okay, we can <laughs> go to a different yeah, question. No. Who are the best players in table tennis from the late 90s and the knows. early 2000s? We don't know. Chin, South Korea, Sweden. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Awkward silence. Sorry, it's China, South Korea. All right, your last question. Who was one of the main characters in Stranger Things that made an appearance in it? The new one. Wait, huh? Who was one of the new main characters or actors that made an appearance on the show Stranger Things? Um, 
I knew it was a boy and a girl. No. No? Finn Wolford, he played Mike. That was your last entertainment question. Really? All right. This is the last history question, and it's worth five points. Aaron, you could come back with this. Ugh. Which two, and if you get it wrong, you get minus three points. Okay. Which two secretaries of state never married? What? Which two secretaries of state never got married? <laughs> I don't know supposed to know that. <laughs> like, do you know that? No. Do you, I, like, can you give us a hint at least? A hint is that one is a girl and one is a boy, and the last name of one of them is a food. A food? No. Yeah, you're not going to get it. It is James Buchanan and Condoleezza Rice, but none of you guys answered it, so none of you guys get minus three. That's it for history, and that's it for entertainment. We move down to science. What planet in our solar system has the most gravity? The moon. The moon is not a planet. Ah, they, I, I can't forget. Charles, do you have an answer? Saturn. No, it is Jupiter. That is minus three points okay, for Charles. Why did you say about Jupiter? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're getting like three points. Three points. <laughs> oh, my God. This, is, this game is getting really dead. What country includes the following landmarks? Table Mountain, Cougar National Park, and the Victoria Alford Waterfront. What's the question again? Which, which country includes the following landmarks? Table Mountain, the Kruger National Park, and Victoria Alfred Waterfront. Uh, um, wait, like, A hint is it's in the Southern Hemisphere. Um, Do I lose points if I answer it wrong? You lose points if you don't answer. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Brazil. It was wrong. You lose minus three points. Wait, <laughs> It was South Africa. Oh, okay. That, that, I don't think we'll ever get to this. Oh. Is, uh, okay. The score right now is four to eight. It is still in reach. Your second to last sports question. Who is the only Cuban world chess champion? <laughs> you give us a hint? Like, do, do I lose a, points? A hint answer? is his first name is Jose. It is next last name is Capa Blanca. So if you get his middle name right, you get the question right. Capa Blanca. If I answer it uh, wrong, do I get minus no. points? Okay, I'm not gonna answer because he's. If you answer it right, you get three points. Capa Blanca. Okay, so his middle name is his first name is first name's Jose. His last name is Capa Blanca, and his middle name is blank. If you get that right, you get three points. Does he not have a middle name? <laughs> Incorrect. <laughs> it is Jose Raul Capablanca. Raul. I don't, I, don't, I don't think. All right. This is your last sports question. Where is the Westminster Kennel Club day show held? What? 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 <laughs> I'll give you a hint. There is two sports teams that play there. And it is not Chicago. There's only one other city that has two MLB teams that play there. Is it a city or state? A city, but it's in a state. Um. New York? Correct, it's New York City. And that was the last question of geography. That is five points for Aaron. Yeah. Five points. Are you kidding me? Two, three, four. <laughs> Nine to eight, Aaron takes the lead for the first time all day. Oh and we only have <laughs> four questions left. Can was, Charles a guess. come back? Was just a guess. A science question for one point. Okay. What was the last man to walk on the moon? Sorry, who was the last man to walk on the moon? Um, I don't um, know. I forget. I don't know. It was Captain Eugene Cernan. What is the largest animal on Earth? A lion. Incorrect. Ooh, really? Blue whale. Correct. That is oh. one point for Charles. It is a tie game. 
can this game get any better? Oh, no, wow. it can't, because it is tied. We have two questions left, and this is your last science question for one point, though, because we're tied. What does NASA stand for? National Aeronautics Space Association. You are four or five words right, so you get zero points. <laughs> oh, okay. One question left, or else we go to tiebreaker. Okay. Name the one country that does not have a rectangular flag. China. Incorrect. Um. A big hint is Mount Everest is in this country. Ooh. Um. 30 seconds. Tibet. Incorrect. It was Nepal. Uh, so we have a tie game. We have one last question. Whoever gets it takes all. It will be an easy question. Okay. The category, do you guys have any preference of the category? Sports. Sport. Oh, I didn't right. get the pick. The question is, name two players on the San Francisco Giants. Brandon Belt, Brandon Crawford. That is the winner. Your winner oh, is wow. Charles, and he takes the win today. He is 1-0, and that makes Aaron 0-1, oh, and, and that was the game. So, Charles, what are you going to do with the money after um, winning $30,000? I was going to buy a new globe and... Yeah, that's it. By a really fancy globe. Aaron, are you going to keep doing trivia or your day's done? Uh, I'll try. All right, so that's it for us. Thank you for watching, everybody. Have a great day, and we'll see you next time. Here on MC Trivia. <laughs> <laughs>